Hi, I'm Doug. I'm painting with Doug. Come join me. Hi, I'm Doug. I'm painting with Doug. And today we're going to start on the white canvas. We're going to start with all the shadows, all the dark areas. I'm going to, I'm going to paint with red. So that's how I do my drawing before I do the painting. And so I will start. And I'm going to do a boat on the, uh, on the in the inlet in Port Moody. Start with, and I, what I'm doing is just doing the rough shape. And this this boat is like uh, about 100. It's been in the inlet for about 60, 80 years, and it's 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 right now. It's, at the skeleton stage, where the, every year the boat slightly disappears, and I want to capture the history of this this wonderful little boat that I see in the inlet. Just really, really interesting. Okay, so when I when I walk in the parks, I, I always look for the things that a lot of people just walk by and don't even pay attention to. Some of the best things in life are things that go on those. Oh, ponies are so elegant creatures that you can ride. They're so much fun. Especially when I was a kid, you look forward to riding a pony. They go everywhere. And this is the first stage is trying to get the shades where you want them, where you want the landscapes to go, where the lines are going to go. You draw it real, you paint it really fast or draw it really fast, however you want. And you get these wonderful s strokes. And you, you will end up with a, a balanced pic picture. <laughs> No, I do not. He wants me to talk about the uh, the black people. I should probably start with another color. And what color should I start with? I want to chew gum with an Indian. Hi, everybody. We are back in some exciting news. Um, my Doug got. I'm kicked in the face by a skinhead, but we're still going on. And another thing, I've got to this stage where the now I'm adding the blue and then the darks and the light, and my ship is coming along. And it's just all I'm doing is the underlay before I start getting more detail. And uh, another thing I've always I always felt with when I draw or paint, I feel like. When you see those black people with beautiful bodies and it's like so smooth and shiny and muscular and I'm trying to put that into my paintings because it just you, you see all the lights and the darks, it's so it's it's fascinating when you think of it. it it helps you with your painting just to see all these different things that you like to to do with. You, you you're just free at what you're doing and Really good art that you see in nature. It's, these artists are just free and, and they just go for it. And there's no rules. The only rules that are is what you feel you need to do. And with this base coat, it's so important because you can always change it over time and you can make it work the way you want it. And I'm using acrylic paint, and I just I just find it's forgiving because it you can it dries really fast, and you can go over it, and you don't have to wait forever for oil to dry. And this is a really it's an interesting paint. You can paint whatever you can use a brush, you can use your fingers, you can use your whatever you want to use. This is 
or and the looser you are, you'll be surprised how well your, your painting's gonna turn out. And just just watch how I do it and not worry about your Don't worry about the result until the end. It's really fascinating. I'm just I'm putting in the green for the the base coat for where the, the bushes are on this side and they're on the, the bottom. Hi, I'm the 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 painting I'm doing is has is the called the ship that has souls in it that's been because the ship is over a hundred years old and it's decaying at the beach in Port Moody and, and it's decaying like a dead body with, and with the same soul blah 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 I, I, I'm on the trolls that are I was born in 1869 and I was on this ship that was, we, we were lost and we crashed on this beach and we all fell off and we all died and now I'm, I'm haunting this little boat that's still there at the beach. So if anyone goes near it, watch out for the troll, the ghosts. Hi, this is the finished result of that painting that I started with, and this is the result I came up with. I call this the Lost Ship, and this was this was done in on the beach in Port Moody, and it's the ship is over 100 years old, and every year I go to it, it's decaying, it's getting there's less and less of it every year, so it's. What you're seeing is the result it's in now, and in a few years there'll be less of this detail, and it's really interesting to watch. Wherever you want to go, ride a pony! Hi, I'm Doug. I'm painting with Doug. Come join me next time! Is that...